every year when we come back to visit friends in Hill Country in, te in Texas, we always cut our Christmas tree that we'll use for the holidays. And this year we're going to be hunting for our newest tree. It's not what you would expect. And Bob and Bob Jr. are going to help us. Let's go down that road. Hello, faithful people. I'm Orlean. I'm Gary. And this is Bob and Bob Jr. And we are going to go looking for a Christmas tree. Yeah. And I get to cut it down. Yeah. Or something. <laughs> it's not your traditional Christmas tree. Most people shop for evergreens. We're shopping for a dead branch. <laughs> <laughs> that is going to be the right size, the right, right shape and hopefully with a little lichen on it so we'll have the green. Are you kidding me? A dead branch? That sounds really silly to me. This is a healthy live oak tree that has not been affected by the disease yet. This is the size of the acorn. They're pretty little. And the leaves are little, as you can see. Not your typical oak tree like we have in Wisconsin. Oak wilt is one of the most destructive tree diseases out of all tree diseases in the United States. And it has affected just thousands of acres in central Texas. On the ground, it's caused by a beetle. And underground, it's caused by fungus that connects the roots and so if the trees are close together it's going to connect the, the tree roots with that fungus. It makes me sad. Me too. Well we're gonna do something to give new life to at least one of these branches. What about this one? Well it's really pretty Bob and it's nice and soft and it's alive, so we don't want to cut this down. Oh. Sorry. All right. How about this one? No, it's not quite the right shape. No, it's too, no, that's not it. All right, come nice on, Nice try. <laughs> yeah, this one's a little more interesting here. This one, maybe, uh, it might be too, I don't know, that's pretty big. Ah, that's probably too big. Okay, Bob. <laughs> we can be like the three bears. This <laughs> one's too soft. This one's too hard. This one's just right. But it's uh, gone. It's gone. And we took it. Yes, we got a tree. We got a tree. And we're going to show it to you later when Gary's strapping it in the truck. Gary is securing our tree in the truck. <laughs> For the travel down to Corpus Christi. I think we picked a really pretty one this year. Exceptional. Isn't it gorgeous? Yeah, all the red colors and <laughs> foliage and just perfect. It is. <laughs> a lot of people call it a Charlie Brown tree and they love it. I so, think Charlie Brown's even had more than this one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but wait, you'll have to tune in, subscribe, so that you can see how we decorate her. It'll be amazing. Epic. Christmasy. <laughs> yes. <laughs> if you want to know more about the Texas oak wilt, just look it up on, on Google it or whatever, and, and you'll learn more about it. So if you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button down below. Next to it, a little bell is going to pop up. And ring the bell, and you'll be notified every time new videos come up. If you don't ring the bell, you won't know when we have new videos up, and you'll be missing out. You got to see how we decorate it. Until next time, God, God bless. bless.